Hi everybody, it's Julie, and I have a part of a haul from a silent auction at our church. And what we did is we put all of the paper goods into one category, and I'm so excited I, I won. And I haven't even gotten to really see what was in here. So there were a bunch of National Geographic maps. Um, I think that they will be, make great envelopes or fold outs possibly for, um, some journals. This one is Crucible of History, the Eastern Mediterranean, Medieval England. This one looks like it's got some pictures. So there's that one. The March Toward Extinction. I'll probably check these out pretty good before I start tearing them up or cutting them up. But I think that it'll be fun. This one said Fairy Tale Road. <laughs> Follow the Brothers Graham to Hamlin to see a weekly Pied Piper pantomime. So this one's a traveler's map of Germany. Asia Pacific. So. so it's got lots of water. There we go. So blue. Yeah. This one, British Columbia. North America in the Age of Dinosaurs. Here's one, China. Deep Sea Vents, Worlds Without Sun, Pacific Ocean. The Middle East, Ancient Maya World. Tidewater and Evirons. A Traveler's Look at Australia. Quebec, Amazonia, a world resource at risk. You know, I just got that, um, the Amazon book. I've already put it away, but I got that at Goodwill. So this one is a, like a topography map, which is kind of cool. But I think they'll make, again, I think they'll make great envelopes and... Uh, again, possibly fold out type pages. This one is the Inca, a world transformed, state of the planet. So, another map. The two Koreas. Map. Another one, Middle East. You, world War II, Europe and North Africa. Africa. Okay, this one had four of these yellow notepads. These are actually really nice. They're nicer than the ones I've been getting. Um, really nice. So that'll be good to have. Oh, some three-wing binder. Um, nine and a half by six, a hundred sheets. Looks like it's brand new. This I this is cool. Um, little labels. There's 20 of them, so there must be two sides. There is, and they're all different, and they're quite cute. They're looks like they're in Spanish, but the the tags are really cute. I like the glitter. Oh, some gel clings. What's this? This is restick. Okay, so these can. They kind of feel like fabric, but they they'll stick on and restick. We have some specialty papers. The, it's Halloween, so very cool. Oh, two packages, two packages of Halloween specialty papers. Okay, let's put these down here. White return address labels. A whole 
big, huge package of white return address labels for laser and inkjet. Ultra premium photo paper, glossy. Kodak photo paper. And then this big, huge laser HP papers from 2006. All glossy. I mean, there is a this like a whole package. So that is. See, I hadn't even been able to look and see what was. I saw the maps, and um, I was like, okay, you know. And it's one of those where you buy tickets and then you put your tickets in the bags, or this time it was cups. And I was like, well, you know what? I want. I want the maps. Is I can make envelopes out of the maps and look at how many is there. That's a lot. And um, so, and then I could see these. So that's um, that's awesome, awesome, awesome. So it was one of those where you buy your tickets and then you put your tickets in the things that excuse me that you would want it want to win. So I wanted to win this, and I did. Yay! So I hope you enjoyed my little silent auction haul. And um, what was your favorite thing that I got? I'm really excited about those maps. The Halloween paper is cool, too. I mean, look at how many. There's like one, 60 sheets in one, and the other one doesn't feel like it's got hardly any out of it. So there we go. Find something to celebrate every day. Don't forget to subscribe. Have a great day. Bye.